Hey there guys, it's me once again, and today I will do a react video, but this time, this is going to be on Mrs. Butterfly Fighter's Famous Players Theatre's UK launch, so enjoy. So you know remember my music and renovation? Oh, I know. Huh? Oh, you tell me then. Realized I used the uh, thingy as well. Yeah, um, you used tune from 2009 until 2016 before they fold over to Cineplex Feeders. Alia listens to his music. Alia? Ollie? Ollie? What? Did you did you listen to that music? No. <laughs> he didn't. Remember, however, I can do this. But this music was a calming, relaxing tune. Actually, it uses the laser part as well. For now, this was used for our famous players, IMAX feeders, from 2009 to 2016 before they fall to Cineplex in some locations. Well, I know. Well, Cineplex has been around for that, for that quite long. Well, it's been here in Canada for a long time in 1936. But don't worry, they'll still be on some locations, including the Quebec one in France. Actually, there's French version of Famous Players as well. But it also announces Cineplex Odeon as well, thanks a lot to Arliard for finding the Famous Players Colosseum, which is where it was back then. Here's with his music when I was at night. I remember the Cineplex Odeon when I was at Canada. I remember Cineplex Entertainment, yeah. Also, Cineplex Entertainment, formerly known as Cineplex Odeon, was a very good understanding theatre. I love that tune. Other cases in the laser night. Oh, I wish I can do it in the laser. Actually, that screenshot was eventually taken from I Love 1984, which I'm going to comment on that. But I did, actually. Or maybe just outside of Kaleidoscope. Well, I just we never that um far, but it's just absolutely the screenshot from I Love 1961. I think you just did this very far for quite a long. <laughs> and also, just doing something. Oops, sorry, I had to turn off my captions. It's a good video. Sorry. Whoops. And I have a really hat on. Mm. Really hat. Mm. Should I tell like this? You're dancing like a pose. <laughs> or maybe I look funky. You what? <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> Oh god. If you want to listen to this with Philly, if you want to ask Philly if you want to listen to this music while wow, using this online, if you want to know about this. Oh no, no, no. Actually, I don't know. Philly. Maybe. It's wrong idea. <laughs> if you want to listen to him with your play. Yes, your can do that too. Ah, oh, no. No. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> so that is a screenshot for I Love 1994. Ow! Ow, ow, I just hurt my head. I just hit in a wall with my head. Ow, ow, ow! That hurt me. And finally, outside in a blistery weather. Right, I had to destroy that. Toy, you stay there. Zoop. And slay up and slay up and slay up. It's toy all round. Is it you? <laughs> now, that's the amazing fact how I play. Okay, what about this then? Well, however, <coughs> remember, Famous Players is now coming to UK very soon. And you know what? It's open. Visit Famous Players today. Well, Famous Players was, would even know. But there's also Famous Players outside of my house. Famous Players. So you know what? Famous Players, a partnership with IMAX. Are you going to listen to Mr. Music again? Let me think. Right, that's the video. Now, let's check the description. Excuse me. Alright, you give credit to even blacks for the video. It's here, Famous Players, based off the Canadian version which opened in 1936. <clears throat> Later, Cineplex Entertainment, formerly known as Cineplex Audio, yeah, I just said before, purchased Famous Players theaters in Canada and closed off some locations. Some locations are replaced with Cineplex and some locations still use the Famous Players menu in Canada. Well, I just went, I used, sorry. Do you know what? I got on Google Maps and I went to Cineplex theaters in Canada. I saw Famous Players. I traveled back in 2009 in Google Maps on the time machine. Google Maps. There's a street view and there is... And I, I saw Famous Players, which is a Colosseum. And also, in 2022, Famous Players Theatres opens a UK brand in London, however. <clears throat> And yes, it was open on 3rd of February, and this time, yeah, I do Toys R Us, but... Alright, that's all for now, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Cheerio! Sorry. Cheerio!